Hello, I'm Kurt Lidke with the Herald and News. Here's a rundown of some of the top stories affecting the Klamath Basin. It's the Klamath County. Klamath County Commissioners voted unanimously on Wednesday to set aside $250,000 as a financial incentive for a prospective airline to restore commercial service from Klamath Falls to San Francisco. The funding would come from an estimated $400,000 in unspent general fund revenue from the previous fiscal year. The commissioners are the first of what is hoped to be several entities helping to raise as much as $700,000 in incentives for an airline to return service in Klamath Falls after Penn Air declared bankruptcy in early August. In Lake County, Lakeview High School principal Jesse Hamilton resigned suddenly when an opportunity arose to become the new principal at Brixner Junior High in Klamath Falls. Hamilton and his wife are both from Klamath Falls originally, and he previously worked at Henley High School, making the opportunity to come home simply too tempting to pass up. Hamilton had served as vice principal and last year as principal over the past four years for LHS and Daly Middle School in Lakeview. It marks the second year in a row that administrators in Lakeview have been left scrambling a week before the start of the school year after a tragic hit and run accident last year killed beloved mathematics teacher Noni Vandenberg only a few days before school began. The renowned matriarch of the Hyde family and historic Yamsey Ranch in northern Klamath County, Gerda Hyde, has died, family members confirmed on Thursday. Even into her 80s, she worked cattle, helping employees and family members tally heads on the Yamsey Ranch. The 5,000-acre ranch is now entering its 107th year of operations under the same family, with a herd of around 400 cows, and even the occasional wolf or two, and a fly fishing resort that counts 450 guest days during summers. For her contributions to ranching, family, and community, the Herald and News named Gerda its 2011 Citizen of the Year. Chelsea Gamble has been riding motorcycles, dirt bikes, and just about anything else on two wheels all of her young life. However, when a drunk and erratic driver sideswiped the motorcycle she was riding on with her boyfriend in Central Point back on August 20th, her life changed dramatically. She lost her left arm and left leg in the accident, but this 27-year-old Klamath Falls resident is not letting the incident dampen her spirits. She's facing the reality of it head on, posting pictures of her progress on her Facebook site for the world to see. It happened. I would rather everyone see it from me than hear it secondhand, she told the Herald and News from her Portland hospital bed. I'm alive. I've got another arm and leg, so I'm going to be okay. Her only regret is not being able to see her four-year-old daughter start preschool next week. Oh, and uh, she does plan to find a way to keep riding. So the annual Lake County Fair and Roundup is officially underway in Lakeview through Monday, and next week the Tule Lake Butte Valley Fair kicks off on Thursday in Tule Lake. Also this Saturday is Astronomy Day at Lava Beds National Monument, so head out and enjoy the night skies. Until next week, for these stories and so much more, be sure to pick up your daily copy of the Herald and News, or visit us online at heraldandnews.com.